tithe is the first 10% of your increase, which you give to God for the support of His church on earth. That's what they say. Some people tithe, and some do not. However, it seems that those who tithe have their finances better under control. Tithing is generally thought to be a Jewish custom. But it's more than that. It's a requirement from God. When you do not tithe, God considers you to be a thief. Did you know that? Malachi chapter 3 verses 8 through 11 Will a man rob God? Yet you have robbed me. But you say, Wherein have we robbed thee? In tithes and offerings. You are cursed with a curse, for you have robbed me, even this whole nation. Bring ye all the tithes into the storehouse, that there may be meat in my house. And prove me now herewith, saith the Lord of hosts, if I will not open to you the windows of heaven and pour out a blessing, that there shall not be room enough to receive it. And I will rebuke the devourer for your sakes, and he shall not destroy the fruits of your ground. Neither shall your vine cast her fruit before the time in the field, saith the Lord of hosts. God also promises to bless you when you tithe. So, there is a preponderance of reasons to tithe. Who was the first person to tithe? Adam. Immediately after Adam sinned, God showed Adam how to sacrifice a lamb to God. Everyone knows that's how God also showed Adam how to make clothing for himself and his family. However, the crucial question is, how often was Adam required to do this sacrifice? He was required to make a burnt sacrifice of the first tenth of his flock. Thus, as Adam tithed every tenth lamb, he continually made the required sacrifice to God. When we get to heaven, tithing will no longer be required. But while you are here, should you be tithing? In the Hebrew economy, one-tenth of the income of the people was set apart to support the public worship of God. Thus Moses declared to Israel, All the tithe of the land, whether of seed of the land or of the fruit of the tree, is the Lord's. It is holy unto the Lord. And concerning the tithe of the herd or of the flock, the tenth shall be holy unto the Lord. But the tithing system did not originate with the Hebrews. From the earliest times, the Lord claimed a tithe as his. And this claim was recognized and honored. Praise Jesus.